Hi everyone. This is my first live presentation. I want to welcome you all. Uh, color presentation is not going to be too long. I just want to talk about this drawing today. As you will find out, as you get to know my artwork, the artwork is a vessel for what I have to say and my piece on the world. So I'll start here. My name is Leonardo and I create art. The art, as I mentioned, is a vessel for what I have to say about the world. I want to start with this drawing here, which represents what I call the leopard's path, also known as the leopard's paw. What is the leopard's paw? The leopard's paw is the path of this right here, the spots. We all have spots. We all have shadows. We all have parts of ourselves that we don't like, that we hide. But guess what? Everyone else can see them. Everyone else can perceive them in some way. And society makes a big deal about hiding these spots, but it's not doing a good job because as you can probably tell, we're in a big mess. There's a lot of shit happening in the world because Everybody has been told to hide their spots. And the leopard's, pa, leopard's paw, or the leopard's path, sorry, is about embracing those. Embracing your spots. And not to, careful not to go in the other direction of, of pride, like being arrogant about it. Because that's what I call the lion's path. The lion's path is about pride, arrogance, tyranny, and ultimately destruction and as anyone with the discerning mind can see there's a lot of arrogance there's a lot of pride in today's world and that's precisely because society and our parents and schools and jobs their whole bit is about programming us to hide who we really are including our spots including our shadows so what happens is, in the leopard's path, it's about embracing that, having the humility to realize that, you know what, I have mistakes, I'm not perfect, and that's okay. So, that's what those spots represent. The leopard wears his spots, he doesn't hide them. The lion hides his spots. Fun fact, when lions are born, and they're cubs, they have, they have small spots, and as they grow up, they fade which is symbolic of how when we're children, we're very, we have our characteristics are both good and bad that are very obvious to everyone. And as we grow up, as we go through the schooling process, those get, those get suppressed. People tell us to act this way or pretend to be fake. We become lion-like, prideful, arrogant, and that's what that represents. And, and I'm walking the, the leopard's path, which is, as I mentioned, the path of humility, the path of healing, the path of being authentic. Now, what happens here is, ironically, when we embrace our spots and we accept them for what they are, that's what heals them. The, the healing waters of, of grace come upon us and our spots wash away but here's the thing our spots don't I mean in terms of psychology our, our wounds are going to be there but they wash away we don't see them because they're not in our face anymore they're not preventing us from being ourselves and we can feel like we're cleansed in a way but as I mentioned that only comes about when we embrace our spots when we embrace who, who we are both the, the dark and the light so this drawing represents all that. And that's the, so the leopard, this walks through the healing waters of, of the, of grace, and it becomes the golden panther. So notice he, his spots are not there, but he has been redeemed. It's symbolic of how our good qualities are redeemed once we, once we heal and once we are able to wash away the superfluous and fakeness that 
comes about. And funny enough, like our the, the spots have their own beauty. Like even with all our flaws, there's a beauty to being human, which includes our flaws, includes the imperfections. And I think that's another key point. So I would love to expand on that as, as time goes on. But for the time being, I appreciate your time and I appreciate your attention with this. And I hope you enjoy the drawing. Have a good one.